Good morning and welcome to Daily Connections with Pastor Scott. I trust that your morning is starting off well as mine has and I want to begin this morning by first apologizing for not uh, getting any videos up last week. Um, I was sick last week with a pretty bad stomach virus that took me out for about three days and uh, so I was not able to uh, make any daily connection videos but I'm in I'm back in action again uh, this morning, and it is good to be with you. And um, so I want to start this uh, brief reflection this morning with a question. Um, what are you known for? Uh, what will you be known for after you are gone? Are you known for the money you make, uh, the success of your career? Are you uh, known for your hobbies and your interest? Uh, are you known for things that perhaps you shouldn't be known for? Um, I pose this question this morning because I want to read uh, what Paul said about the Christians in Rome, the church in Rome, and something that they were known for. And so I've begun reading through Paul's letter to the Romans uh, this week. And uh, in Romans chapter 1, in his prefatory comments to the church, uh, to a church he had yet to have been able to visit, but was planning on doing so, he wrote these words concerning these Christians. First, I thank my God through Jesus Christ for all of you, because your faith is being reported all over the world. And so as Paul uh, in his various missionary journeys was starting churches and preaching and teaching the gospel along the Mediterranean coastline, he kept hearing about these faithful Christians uh, in the city of Rome, which was the epicenter of not only the Roman Empire, but of the world at that time. He kept hearing these good reports of their faithfulness. This is what they were known for. Uh, and it's my hope and prayer that at the end of the day, uh, that that is what my life will be known for. And it's my hope and prayer that that is what your life will be known for. And so the Lord asked of us this morning, what is being reported all over the world? about you and me. Have a great morning and I'll see you tomorrow for another Daily Connection.